Hello and welcome back to the BTPHD Plays Life is Strange. Last time we gathered intel on Nathan Prescott, uh, where we were warned that he is off campus, um, and to stay the hell away from him, so at least we know that he's in a shitty mood today, and that we should stay away from him, which is probably the exact opposite of what we are going to do. Um, but we have all our intel that we need, so let's go sass Chloe and her little friend Justin, who is adorable. Sweet fist brump. Brump. Coast is bump. clear. Whatever. It would be so cool if you and me were going to school here together. But now you can have Mr. Jefferson all to yourself. Oh my god. Oh, you suck. Now let's get into Blackwell Ninja mode. I love them. They make my heart happy. It's so lame. They don't have co-ed dorms here. Yes, because I want Nathan Prescott in the room next door. Good point. <laughs> Wait here. Give me the signal if Nathan or anybody shows up. I won't let you down, Batmax. <laughs> now I just have to find Nathan's room. Just in case we missed the objective. Hi, Kate. Do you have words for me? Evan. Of course. That's why no shits were given. <laughs> Evan rolls. He's pretty festive. Safety first. Apparently Logan missed this poster. <laughs> oh. Uh, always use protection, kids. It's, it's for the best. Because, because babies. Also sexually transmitted diseases. Oh, why, hello, Trevor. And Dana. Eavesdrop. Nope. Hello, toilet paper. Are toilet paper wars mandatory in the dorms? Seems that way. Uh, no. Not interested in the men's bathroom. Who is? Even after Kate, nobody here learned anything about bullying. Do, do I even know who's... Who's this is? Oh, jerks. At least nobody messed with the Kate portrait. Wow. Ah, the magic of school. Douchebaggery abounds. That's why growing up sucks. What? Zach or Logan? Who knows? Bro's got a bro. Uh, no comment. Ugh, skunk weed and video games. I sense Hayden is near. Ha <laughs> ha! He shares hobbies with people that I know. This can only be Nathan's room. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna check out the other doors first, because real talk. Hello, Warren's room. Hawking and him make a good team. Aw, he was so adorable. Poor Warren. Oh, lame. This is the work of Nathan. He's so lucky I'm a pacifist. Otherwise, all the beatings. I'm gonna guess Warren's not in. Looks like one of the jocks did care about Kate. Aw. Yay. Uh, no, I do not care to check out the, uh, the football poster. No offense to anyone who loves football. I just don't get it. Jesus. Is no one gonna hear that? <laughs> like, she's just like, ah, fuck the rules. It's cool. This isn't. Now I need to find Nathan's phone. Okay. Or anything with clues. Okay, I suppose I should check my messages. Okay. Um. Okay, message from Joyce Max. Now that David is not here, I need Chloe to step up and stop acting out so much. But that won't happen if you and her are getting mixed up in illegal crap like breaking into Blackwell at night. I know it happened, so don't bother to defend or explain. I uh, hope you would get back on the right track, but it looks like she's getting stuck again. 
Uh, you could be such a good influence on her, unless you both want to play bad, but she can't keep blaming David now. I'm sorry, Joyce. I, even I get into shenanigans. But I'm trying to be a good influence on Chloe. I know, Max. I forget you're still teenage adults. Adults. Adulting. Okay. Uh, SMS messages. Kate, what's up? Uh, yeah. Being careful. Cute little wavy bits. Yay. Okay. Cool. Cool. Let's rummage through someone's private property because legal stuff is lame. It's not really, it's not really true. Um, kids don't, don't break the law. Diploma. That's so cute and ironic. Oh. I can't believe Nathan still has it around. Maybe Nathan is still a... Uh... That monochrome camera is brand new and costs about six grand. <laughs> Bastard. Yay, rich family. Mm. Fancy lens. I thought Victoria had the photo bling, but once again, the Prescott's rule. Fashion mag prescription pills. I don't think this prescription has helped Nathan. Especially not if he's taking it with some form of booze. Usually those don't mix too great. Porno mags? Nathan Prescott. All American teen. Porno mags. In the least creative storage place. Damn, Nathan. That's a nice shot. If only all your energy went into photography. Right? It's so damn creepy, but the guy has his own style. It is good. It is just super creepy. More porn? I don't think one book can guide the Prescotts. That cover's terrifying. I'm not turning on the mp3 player. That must be the lamp Chloe broke when Nathan drugged her. Uh, can I get a photo of that? I would love to get a photo of that, please. That must be the lamp Chloe broke when Nathan drugged her. Okay, well, so much for that. That looks like a totally fun show. <laughs> Even Nathan has a light side. Uh, I would like to point out that that poster doesn't really tell us anything at all about the show. That is so Chloe. <laughs> hey, asshole, we need to talk. Or I'm going to tell everybody what you did. You're going to pay him, motherfucker. That's awesome. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Chloe. Oh, Chloe. That is upsetting. Very, very upsetting. I am upset now. Nathan clearly has his fetish down. Right? Uh... Oh, I'm so creeped out right now. Uh, uh, uh. Holy shit. That's the gun Nathan used on Chloe. A gift from... Uh, he's such a creep. Nathan likes his tortured subject. He has everything in here except peace of mind. Uh. These films all have a dark pattern. I don't like this kid. I don't like it. I'd cry too if I had him for a father and had to wear that suit. Ugh. Ugh. Okay. Nope, we already looked at that. Computer time. Let's see what Nathan hides in here. That was not what I was expecting. Nathan is way into this party. To the Bad sign. Oh, sorry. Sorry, sorry for jumping, jumping your line. Uh, hey, gorgeous. Let me know what you're wearing to the vortex this week, so I can wear something just as stylish and expensive. I'm psyched about going, and I'm picking up some serious potty favors. I told my dad to keep the pigs away from Blackwell so we can get wrecked without hassle. If we're going to have an end of the world theme, let's do it, fucking on point, right? Ha! Ah. Oh, bastard. Now I remember why I hate you. And why Kate will get justice. Oh man. Sean Prescott might be Nathan's real problem. Gonna guess that's his dad. Nate, I know this has been a stressful week and your mother and I are here to talk if need be. Just make an appointment anytime. Your mother wants Dr. Bill to come out after his book tour, but for now let's stick to your prescriptions. I need you to calm and quiet. I need you calm and quiet while Panastase is being developed. You know, being a Prescott is a burden, and I'll guide you into the room every step, as did my father. 
into this room step by step. Okay. Reading is hard. Nah. Uh, uh, it was hard for me when my dad opened my eyes to our destiny, but you'll thank me someday. Don't worry about Blackwell. The shithole town is going to get an enema along with a fresh brand. I want you to be ready to take over when the moment is right. Don't fuck it up, son. Your father. Hmm. Too bad Nathan isn't more like his sister. She sounds awesome. Aww. And far away. Tudo them? I suppose I could click read, but whatever. Uh, little brother, it's been too long since I've heard from you, so please let me know what's going on in your exciting scholastic life at Blackwell. I bragged to all my co-workers at the Peace Corps that my talented bro Nate got a full scholarship to one of the best art schools in the world. Even though I can't always check my mail or phone, please 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 send me some new photos of campus so I can live vicariously through your lens. I miss you and your pictures. And yes, mother told me you've been in trouble and father's been on your ass, but you have to either ignore him or stand up to him. You know I love dad Nate, but I'm also in a jungle halfway across the world because of him. He's a bully who inherited power, not wisdom, and the only way to win against one is to fight back. Don't let him charge. Uh, don't let him change you into one of, into one just for family legacy. End of lecture. You're at school, so I just want to make you feel at home. Uh, back to the mangrove. Sending out good thoughts. Better write back, rob a jaguar, ship to your dorm. Oh, she seems cool. Yes, Nathan sure needs diet pills. What? This is strong stuff. Uh, pretty wow. sure that's used for something else. Kiss ass much, Principal Wells. Nathan, I'd like to apologize for the recent accusation. Your name and record speaks for itself. Sometimes students will use that to make their own name at Blackwell. I know your father was upset, while I have reassured him that you would never bring a weapon to school. I don't want you distracted from school, and I'm certain this matter will be settled by the end of the week. If you have any questions, you know I'm always available to talk. Name. Okay, well. Oh, here's another photo. Oh, man. That dickhead stole one of my selfies. Also creepy. Okay, I believe we have checked out everything in this room. Which means it's time to- what? What the hell are all those marks on the floor? We should engage in taking photographic evidence. Couch. Move the couch. Okay, we're gonna move the couch. We're gonna move the couch next time on the BT PhD who plays Life is Strange and gets sucked into this game for another like five hours. Okay. See you next time.